Hey everybody, welcome back to Heat My Shorts. Look what I found. We got a gift from somebody. It says it's from Morty Bustos down in Tucson, Arizona. Now we've had a, a parcel from this gentleman before and we were very impressed with what he sent us. Now, it's funny, I was actually, I think I was out doing Christmas shopping and I got home and realized that I had missed a phone call and uh, and also a message that said, accidental call, the guy at the post office needed your info. And I said, no worries. And I asked him what he's up to and he says, I am but a humble sender of sauce. So it sounds like he's just sending us some more goodies that he has. Well, actually, I don't know. I'm, I was going to say that he has created, but I don't want to assume that it's something he has created because I don't know what's in here. Who knows, right? I guess we won't know until I have a seat and open it up. So I'm going to keep this video relatively quick. I wasn't sure whether to do another video tonight or not, but we have the house to ourselves and I'm kind of just bored anyway. So I've actually, to be honest with you, I've had this parcel for a couple of days. It showed up maybe Christmas Eve, but with just the busyness of the holidays, I haven't had a chance to shoot an unboxing video and I didn't want to just open it up. I wanted to open it up on camera because I, I have a lot of fun doing these unboxing videos. Today is the 28th, so we are, it's definitely been like, you know, what is that, three days, give or take? So let's have a seat. Uh, I, I can't wait to see what's in here. I hope you are all having an awesome day today. Some people, I don't know. Never mind, actually. <laughs> Never mind. I always hope you all are having an awesome day. That's just kind of how I roll. I want you all to have an awesome day. Why would I wish anything less on you wonderful people? I hope you've all had an awesome um, Christmas holidays or holiday or past week or weekend or however you want to put it. Ooh, snacks. Oh, look at you. <laughs> what, you want to eat these? I was just kidding, Maggie. This is just styrofoam, Maggie. This part's not the snacks, but I'm actually really glad that you came over to say hello. Because now I don't have to call you and feel guilty about getting Asking you to get up when you're sleeping. You just came over to say hello. Or because you thought there was snacks. But I can pretend that it was because you just came to say hello. Hmm? Yeah, what a good girl. What a good doggy. It's still pretty cold out there. Um, I think it's about minus 15 degrees Celsius. I'm not sure what that is in Fahrenheit. I haven't gotten that one figured out. I know there's a formula. There's a few formulas that I actually saw posted the last time we had a discussion about um, temperatures. Trying to <laughs> grab this out of there without making a mess and spilling these foam peanuts everywhere. Okay. So what do we have here? Looks like a hot sauce. And it looks like a Morty label to me. Oh yeah, and I see the fancy uh, shrink wrap with the foil cap. I think that's foil. I don't know what you call that. The metallic cap. That sounds cool. The gin, hot gin juice. Ooh, curry and assorted super hots. Hot gin. J -j gin. I, I wonder. No, I don't want to. I wonder what the gin is. I don't think that's, no, I, hmm. I'm gonna have to look that word up. Very simple label. I'm not sure what that is there. There's just three lines there. Maybe, well, three lines and a dot. Hmm. Very simple label. Um, no list of ingredients, just curry and assorted super hots. I'm going to give this a good shake. Sounds very thin. It sounds like a thin sauce. Yeah. Ooh, look at that. Isn't that beautiful? 
Those bubbles are taking a while to travel, so it's not a, a totally thin sauce. It's got some substance to it. I'm really excited to review this sauce, because this sauce isn't described in his um, paragraphs of sauce descriptions from the previous, the previous parcel. So I may have to shoot him a message and uh, ask him a little bit about this. I'm going to Google gin, because it's spelled like that, D-J-I-N-N. -N. To be honest, at first I thought it was a Star Wars reference. I thought it was, uh, I was thinking of the Mandalorians named Din Djarin, but it's not quite the same. Pretty close. Could, could be a nod. <laughs> Probably isn't, but uh, thank you very much, Morty. This is really cool that you sent this up. We absolutely love curry in this house, and obviously we, we love hot sauces, and we're very impressed with the first two that you sent up here, so really stoked to try these, this one out and uh, to record a, a review of it sometime in the, in the coming days, weeks, I'm not sure when. I haven't, I haven't uh, looked at my schedule yet. I actually do have a little bit of a schedule. It's more like just a, a row of, uh, of products on top of the, the cupboard. I just kind of put it uh, a hot sauce and a snack and a hot sauce and a snack is the way that I try to do that. And then when I add in an unboxing, that's, that's something else. That's a, that's a bonus video, a twofer, if you will. Um, that's a James J reference. I actually haven't seen James J in the comments for a few days. Hope you're doing well, James. I'll have to maybe shoot you an email, see how you're doing. Um, other than that, not too much else to talk about. Mickey, you are so cute. Um, other than, speaking of Star Wars, I am super stoked. Tomorrow, the Book of Boba Fett launches, the new Disney Plus series. We are so stoked to check this series out. Um, the teaser at the end of The Mandalorian Season 2 was very intriguing. Um, Boba Fett's... I don't want to say too much. It, by now, if you're into Star Wars at all, if you're watching this channel, you probably... No, I don't want to assume you're into Star Wars because Jason, uh, was it Jason? I believe it was Jason. My apology, it might be somebody else. Somebody told me recently, they're like, well, I'm not a big Star Wars fan, but I really appreciate this, this other portion of your video. And I just think that's really cool um, when people that aren't even a Star Wars fan are such a fan of this channel. Because if you look around this house very much, you will see a substantial amount of Star Wars things. Um... I totally lost my train of thought with that. I don't know. I don't know where I was going with that. I'll have to watch the video again to find out what I was talking about. Um, I know I was talking about, about the book of Boba Fett because um, Boba's ship is hanging on the curtains uh, behind the camera right now, so it, it reminded me of it. But, um, right. Yeah, I don't want to reveal anything about that series. Um, other than that there's a, a series about Boba Fett coming out, and um, if you don't know what's going on with Boba Fett, you should watch The Mandalorian, uh, the other Star Wars live-action series that is in between seasons right now. And um, even if you're not into Star Wars, if you're into Western movies, you could definitely get a kick out of this. It's a, it's still a, st a space, you know, a space show. It's It's in and around space, but uh, it's got a very Western feel like the original Star Wars, and uh, have we seen the Force at all in it yet? I'm not even too sure. I don't want to reveal too much, but um, yes, okay. <coughs> Pardon me. Anyways, we're getting way sidetracked here. See what happens when I talk about Star Wars? I could just go on for an hour about Star Wars, and some channels do that. Maybe one day we'll do Star Wars specific episodes on this channel, but that's not what this is. This is an unboxing of a hot sauce gift from our buddy, Morty. Uh, thanks again, Morty. We really appreciate this. We're so stoked to open this up, sample it, let you know what we think of it, and let you know what we're going to pair it with. Oh, like that, with the parrot. It's a parrot. I have to say that more and more so that people know what I'm talking about when I just start talking about a parrot, right? Because we're pairing it with things so I really need to, like, drive that one home for, you know, not too long. Don't want to wear it out either. 
But anyways, speaking of dra dragging things out and wearing things out, I should probably wrap this video up. We are now at 10 minutes, which is our, kind of our average video runtime these days. I've been I've managed to cut down our uh, our record time a little bit. Do you prefer that, or are you wanting more? I guess this is our second video of the day, which we haven't been doing much of. But um, feedback is always welcome. I would prefer if it was constructive criticism and not just telling me that I have a stupid face or something because that doesn't really help anybody. Um, <laughs> and that's a silly example. Um, I'm happy with my face. And I think that the people around me are too. Um, I really appreciate all of you. Speaking of the people around me, um, all of you that take the time to watch these videos and leave comments and interact on different social medias even and uh, my friends that text me and say that was a cool video and my parents that call me and say that was a cool video. You know, all those little things that may seem like a small thing to the people that's giving out the compliment, um, they really hit home with me. I really appreciate that. And that's why I always welcome constructive criticism because um, I'm getting better at listening to uh, uh, criticism and input and feedback and picking and choosing and not saying okay well this person said this so that's what I believe now because that's that's I'm never gonna I'm never going to develop my own ideals going through life that way I'm now picking and choosing getting better at that uh, of picking and choosing the ideals that I choose to abide by the dude abides. I like that quote. That's from The Big Lebowski. Another one of my favorite movies, actually. About due to watch that one. Anyways, way sidetracked, but that was a good little chat, I think. I'm glad that we had that talk. And uh, what, what do you think? Are you, are you glad that we had this talk? Um, a bass player channel that I watch, his name is Davey504. He does a thing once in a while where he has therapy time at the end of his videos, where he just lets you talk. And then once in a while I'll say, mm-hmm, I understand. Mm, that's wonderful. Yes, that's wonderful. Mm, tell me more about that. And it's it's hilarious. That just reminded me of that. If, you, if you're into bass playing, uh, bass guitar, um, or even instruments in, in general, and comedy, this guy's got a hilarious sense of comedy, sense of humor. Uh, Davey504, hilarious. Um, I watch a little bit of his videos for sure. Anyways, I'm going to wrap this video up. Speaking of videos, this one's now been going longer than I intended. So once again, Morty Bustos, our good friend, a lot of our good friend, thank you very much for sharing another one of your sauces. I can't wait to open it up and tell you what I think of it. Um, I'm sure it's going to be great because you seem to know how to make a good sauce. Um, anyways, I hope you all have an awesome day or night, whatever time of the day it is, wherever you are. I noticed there's a lot of glare on this video as well. Um, it's the same lamp we've been using. I don't know why it's having so much trouble today, but that is okay. It seems to be adjusting a little bit too from time to time. What can you do? Technology's funny, isn't it? Um, in this corner you will see our subscribe button. Click the subscribe button, hit all, and hopefully you'll get all notifications, but if not, check back once a day. We usually do one sometimes two videos in a day. Um, subscribe button here and two relevant playlists up he here for you to enjoy. Don't forget to check out the book of Boba Fett tomorrow. It's going to be awesome, I'm sure of it. Uh, this has been Heat My Shorts with Steve and Maggie. We will hang out again soon, I promise. I love you all. Bye-bye.